Hello everyone, my name is Rahul and welcome to my channel Rahul QA Labs. So in today's tutorial, we will be learning how we can assign users to a test project and test plan. Uh, in short, like test project and test plan assignment. Uh, so uh, let's start and uh, as we all know that test projects uh, are the basic organizational unit of TestLink and they are independent and do not share data. And when we talk about test plans, so they are the basis for test execution activities. And a test plan contains a name, description, collection of uh, test cases, builds, milestones, and each test plan is related to the current test project. So all these uh, details uh, about what is a test plan and what is a test project, how to create a test project and how to create a test plan that I have already listed in my previous videos. So if you want, you can go through them and uh, if any doubts you can ask me by your comments so here in today's video we will see how we can assign users to the test projects and test plans and uh, okay so how to assign users to a test plan so all users in the system will by default do not have permissions to newly created test plans suppose i'm creating a test plan and there is another person uh, person a so he will not be having access to that test plan until I gave him the access I give him the access similarly uh, they can only execute the assigned test plans until and unless those test plans are assigned to them they cannot use them or utilize them and these rights can only be given by a leader or an administrator from the test plan management tab so let's see how we can achieve uh, uh, this Let's log in into the test link. So I'm logging in as an administrator. Okay. And uh, let's go to uh, the test plan management. Okay, so as you all can see, uh, we have three test plans uh, created here. These are the sample test plans. Okay, so now assigning a user to a test plan. So suppose I take this test plan TP3 and uh, this is a button that is called the assign roles click on this assign roles it will directly take you to this uh, role management tab okay so see here two tabs are present assign test project roles and assign test plan roles so let's see uh, uh, like how we can assign the test project roles so say for example uh, we have two projects here as of now test project 1 and test project 2 okay so let's take test project 2 as an example now uh, you can take any of the users uh, uh, to assign uh, the test plan to uh, for example i take the user test of one okay so tester one test project two will be assigned the role of a you can select any of the options tester senior tester leader so suppose i select as a senior tester okay and i click on update So see, tester 1, uh, test project role is updated as senior tester. This is for test project 2. Okay. Now coming to assign test plan roles. So these are the options that you uh, can see here. For assigning the test plans, uh, you have to select the test plan from here. Uh, test plan sample 1, test plan TP3. So suppose I take the TP3 as an option and i want to assign uh, a user one or uh, the test of one sorry uh, to this particular test plan so see as of now no rights have been given to this user for this test plan i will select an option from here tester senior tester i will select as a tester and i will click on update okay so see here Tester 1 has been allotted the role of a tester in the test plan TP3. Now, how you uh, will verify that uh, whether these uh, rights are appearing or not? I mean, this user has the access to the test plan or not. For that, let me again change it to no rights. And let me update it. Okay, so now tester 1 has no rights on this test plan tp3 so that means if i log in with test of one that test plan it should not show there 
because it does not have access. So how we can see this? We log out from the administrator and we will log in as tester1. Okay, so this is the home page of tester1. He is a tester and see, it says that you don't have any permissions for an active test plan. Okay, so uh, and uh, again, a test project it is showing because we have given these rights to this tester one from the administrator tab as uh, I have shown you previously. But, uh, he don't have access to any of the active test plans. Now uh, let's log out and uh, go to the administrator login. Go to uh, test plan management. Go to TP3 uh, user roles. Sorry, assign roles. Now, uh, what we'll do is, uh, as of now, no rights are given to this tester one. We'll assign some rights, say, uh, tester, and we will update this. Now, now this tester one should have access to this test plan TP3. So, how we can verify this? Again, log out, uh, log in with tester one. and see current test plan tp3 tester plan role tester got it so this is how uh, we can assign a user to a test plan okay uh, this is pretty much about uh, the user role assignments and let's again log into administrator go to user roles and assign test project roles Okay, so uh, uh, let us take test project two, and uh, you know, uh, suppose uh, now we want uh, this tester one role to be changed to some other role. For example, I take it as a tester and update it. So see, now tester two has been assigned a role of a tester for this project. Now suppose you don't want this project to be accessed by this tester one. So what I will do is in assign test project roles tester one, I'll make it as no rights and I'll click on update. So now tester one should not have access to test project two. And again, how to verify this? Log out. Tester one. Tester one. Okay, so uh, we have logged in to tester1 as a tester and let's see here. This is the test project 1. So this user has access to only one project that is test project 1. This is how you can control the user assignment uh, for, you know, uh, for your test projects and your test plans. Again, if you want uh, this user to access the test project 2, log in with administrator. Go to user roles, go to assign test project roles, test of one, select here as test project two and give him some rights, senior tester. Click on update, <coughs> log out, test of one and test of one logs in and he has access to test project two as well. So this is how you can manage uh, the user management for test projects and test plans. I hope this video uh, explains the basic uh, concept about the user assignment for test plans and test projects. Thank you very much guys for watching my video and if you have any doubts, do uh, put out a comment and I will be happy to answer. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.